We are entering one of the sharpest curves on our line, Oxbow Curve, named by boaters of the Lehigh Canal for its resemblance to a yoke. That oxen used to pull wagons forms almost a half a circle. About halfway through the curve, we will pass underneath what looks like a footbridge. It was actually an oil pipeline suspended above the track in the Eye River, running approximately 450 feet. It was one of the original oil pipelines in the country. It ran between Oil City, PA, and Lincoln, New Jersey, and now carries fiber optic cables. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, 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 no. side of the trail near the river you may be able to see some of the remains of the former canal lock. This portion of the Lehigh Canal from White Haven to Mont Trump was named the Upper Grand section and totaled 20 dams and 29 locks. It was destroyed by a flood in the 1860s and was replaced by the railroad. As we continue on our trip to Old Ten Haven, we may observe numerous mile markers. These markers like mile post 128 that will soon be passing indicates the miles away for Penn Station in New York City. These mile markers have also been created to feature a variety of state wildlife that call the Lehigh State Park home. Yeah. 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 Thick vegetation, rock outcroppings, and waterfalls. 
20 miles of the no. DNL Trail traversed the Jeffrey no. Smoking Pathway into Jim Thorpe. Besides hiking, biking, rafting, and fishing, the yeah. Outdoors also offers outdoorsmen a number of hunting opportunities and photographers will hunt the locations to capture the magnificence no matter the season. Thank you. 